Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Today we're going to continue with Achilles Legends Untold. Uh, this will be episode 13. Um, and uh, we're going to try to seal the rifts. The only issue is like my map glitched somehow from beginning. I don't know if I... I did something wrong, you know, I didn't respect the quest order or something happened, you know. But apparently the... I sealed only one rift, you know what I mean? So now we need to go and find the rest of them. The issue with this is like, I tried to, to look online for a map with rifts, you know. But uh, I couldn't really find one, so... I'm not planning to walk around like a maniac, but we need to find that. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna do my best, you know, to find them. I don't know if I'll be able to find all of them, but it is what it is, basically. So we have here one. I noticed that if I'm passing, uh, you know, if I, for example, if I'm passing next to here, they are appearing like, for example, on the map, they are like getting marked on the map. So we'll need to be at, at least close to them, you know, for them to show on the map. I saw a couple of them, you know, because I checked other YouTubers and I saw like some of them. The rifts are like an endurance test, you know what I mean? Waves are spawning on top of you. And you just need to survive, basically. Kill all the enemies and basically you are sealing the rift. I'm not finding this extremely hard thing to do. We sealed one, you know, in the beginning, but after that... We sealed one, I remember I s the thing is like, as soon as you get out from, I think there's, that's how you bug the quest basically. Cause um, as soon as you get out from that uh, dungeon, you meet the priest and he's granting you the vision basically, yeah? So, because I wanted to upgrade my weapons, cause I was finding like some weapons and I was like, okay, fuck it, I want to upgrade some weapons. I went to to the blacksmith i spoke with him after that he sent me on a different quest and i totally forgot about that rift you know what i mean and uh after a while i i went back to to close the rift but unfortunately they weren't like i didn't get all the location on the locations on the map you know what i mean so this is a grief grief let's uh yeah, so, like you saw, basically you fight some enemies I managed to them. and now you are like, basically, you seal the rift and you are getting out of it. The only thing is like, this is the second rift we sealed on this map. And they need to be like, plenty of them. I saw it's one here close to the wolf then or somewhere around this area. And should be one. I don't remember where exactly, but it should be somewhere here, yeah. These cursed souls won't be coming out of here. For closing them, you are getting like uh, a skill point. So the game is rewarding you one skill point as soon as you close them. The thing is, we are close to an end, you know, the the end of the game. So that's why I want to seal everything, to finish all the secondaries, basically. This is something which you look, you're going to encounter often. Like texture blocking you. Let's teleport. Where the fuck I said? Here. I remember me passing this area, you know? Kill the don't kill me. 
but unfortunately let's see see now it's it's showing you the rift basically i was passing this area but i couldn't see the rift so actually you need to get close to it I'm thinking to. I want to upgrade my armor basically to a maximum level, and after that, I'm thinking to complete the the game with a spear. I don't know if it's the best idea, but maybe that will work. Because we have like a two-hand sword, yeah. I'm gonna show it to you as soon as we close this one. Uh, just because that two-hand sword is scaling A with wrath and strength, I was thinking to rebuild, respect our like fucking skill points into a balanced build, like because you're gonna reach, let's say the a soft cap i know it's not a soft cap but it's similar to a soft cap and i'm gonna explain it to you in seconds okay we seal this one as well okay i'm thinking now how the fuck we're gonna be able to reach there that would be fucking nice. Ah, but I don't think it's possible. We have this one. Now I'm thinking maybe... If we teleport at all points on the map, maybe we're gonna find them. Just to teleport, you know. I know... It's clo one close here to the wolf then, because I saw it, yeah, and appeared, but it's extremely close, that's why it appeared, I guess, on the map. I'm really finding them a challenge. It's because anyway I'm like I guess too OP The only thing is you can still get like stun locked and you can still get like blocked in between them I don't know if they will be able to kill me because I have a extremely big health pool but who knows enemies in this game are like just copy paste it's like basically we fought them like over and over again I'm just trying to keep an eye you know for the dual wielders and I see apparently lions can harm me in a way. Dual wielders are like the nemesis of the game, like tougher than most of the bosses. And in large numbers, you can get fucked by them like big style. Okay, we have like two oh, cyclops. I, I used to call them ogres, you know. Till a, till a point where close to Menelaus, Menelaus estate, an archer is calling them Cyclops and from that point I, I really checked and yeah, they are Cyclops, actually. Okay, now I'm thinking maybe we're gonna have here one. I don't know how often you... 
you will encounter them to be fair but i remember there was a boss fight we fought like a, a she-wolf there there is the place where uh, lysander's daughter died basically and i'm thinking maybe in this area we're gonna find one Oh, here she is. Laoti. Damn it. It doesn't look good. Tell my father it's not his fault. And that I love him. Pass away in peace, child. Bro, what the fuck Make is wrong with the hair? She was supposed to be dead now. I have to deliver the bad news to Lysander. It allowed me to speak with her again. Which is a bit awkward. To be fair with you, it's like... I remember I spoke with her and she told me exactly the same thing, basically. But now I could just speak with her again. Which in a way... It's a bit fucked up. It, it's looking like she's been alive like all this time, you know what I mean, so. She's like uh, holding on to that uh, life. Her story is a bit awkward, you know. Her father was like bringing her to hunt with. Because basically he's a hunter and they came here to hunt. Bandits were like chasing them. He somehow left her here. I don't understand why. He could like to run with her, you know, and all of this wasn't really happening. I remember we've been here. I want to I want to upgrade my weapon like to a maximum level. Come on guys. Maybe it's one rift over there. I'm trying to find all these rifts now. But... It's a bit awkward, you know, because I explored all these regions and... Right now, basically, I'm supposed to do this again. Which, in a way, it's... It's making it way harder than before, you know? Because at least then my map was like... Having the fog of war on it, so... Now everything's unlocked and I have no fucking idea where can we go. I'm thinking maybe here. On this path. Or maybe... Rogue's Bluff, we've been there already. Fisherman's Nook. Maybe something here. It's not showing like. And we have all these types of enemies, you know, which are like basically the same enemy. I'm gonna make a a before you buy guide, so you'll know exactly what to expect from this game. Because creativity levels, it's. Z creativity level is zero on this game. Mm, there are so many aspects that a normal person like me who just played like loads of games can improve this, you know, game like a lot. And it's a bit frustrating because I'm thinking like how the developers didn't fought on these things, you know, like. Because the game is pretty basic, if it's your... Put it like this, if you didn't play a lot of games... 
And this is one of the first games you play. Yeah, it can be interesting. But uh, if you play like at least 10 RPGs, you're gonna find it pretty ba pretty basic. These are like fucking archers. Yeah, so I don't wanna be there. I, I'm just going... Because I'm not gonna spend like crazy amount of time to just unlock this. I, what I'm gonna find, I'm gonna... I'm gonna seal... If I can find more, fuck it, it is what it is. We still have this one. So that's all for the time being. I'm trying to avoid it. I'm just trying to find the the important ones. I saw one of the guys was like sealing one close to the location of the previous. Because this blacksmith, yeah, here is another one. Okay, because here was the blacksmith. You know what I mean? And I saw he was passing uh, this. And the uh, rift appeared. I, can feel the stab death. I think that's why I fucked it up. Because I didn't seal the main rift, which is activating like a cutscene. And uh, if you speak with the blacksmith, the, black, the blacksmith right then will gonna explain you about rift. We're gonna tell you, oh, something about Rift, you know, I don't remember the the dialogue line, but on my playthrough, he didn't mention the Rift, or I don't remember if he mentioned the Rift. Just like... Basic shits. We killed him. The place is safe. I must escape from here. I need to seal it. I hope I sealed that passage. Okay. Where can we go and find another one? I'm thinking maybe here is a rift. Place of despair. This is like Menelaus estate. Maybe on this area. Yeah, let's try to go down here. Because be fair with you for sure, it should be one rift there, you know what I mean, so... It definitely should be one there. Because that area is too big and I don't remember, like... Because the only rift I, I sealed, it was... Basically where the shortcut was. I, I don't even remember, like, properly, but... Okay, so we said we want to get up here. Let's see, nothing popped up on the map. Here is the place where you find Yante. And inside are like Cyclops and their brother. Two dead bodies there. Apparently... They're brothers. Her brothers, sorry. Give me your money faster. English is still challenging me sometimes. Because I'm not a... Main English. English is not my main language, you know what I mean, so... But you can definitely... Realize that. Yeah, they saw me, but 
Tell me that we have a rift here. I remember here was the place where we encounter the... Here was a funny thing because I was exploring, you know? And because I didn't have the vision yet. I didn't know about the... The big guys which are like traversing in between the worlds and all that things. And he was slashing me down. And he was invisible, you know, in the same time. And I was like, what the fuck just happened? We, our health get, got like drained instantly. So unfortunately here we have no fucking rift. Which is disappointing. I don't like the armor a lot. This is basically the end game armor we just crafted it with uh, Hepatitis I'm calling him Hepatitis you know the blacksmith he's apparently like Hades nephew come on guys I hate this I just need to Cause if you let them, they can like fucking, they can do shit to me like, but they are annoying just seeing them there. Okay, so tell me here, we have a rift, no we don't. Here you will encounter like the skeleton king, heroes Yante's body. To be fair with you guys, I was really hoping here would be a rift, but it's not. So I don't know about it, but here we have some malakas to fight. Guys, please chill the fuck out. These are basically the... We're gonna find these enemies in different appearances. See just two of them how annoying they can be. You just continuously knock you down. Imagine put like two more archers there and... Here we fought Menelaus. Yes, yeah, so it's not here. Sparkling stone. Okay. Let's check the map. Ah, it's nothing there. Yeah, I'm just gonna move on with that that rift, which we really have it like uncovered. And fuck it, I am. I'm gonna go to the new map. Yeah, uh, finish all that rift as well. And I don't know. Mm, pff, I think we're gonna move on with the quest, the main quest. Even if we didn't manage to seal them out. All of them. Maybe. Another croc. They are all of them. Maybe. I don't know why some of them are doing nothing. Some of these guys are like quite friendly to us. Come on, my friend, do something. You can't really. Yeah, so let's let's seal this one off. I think these rifts were like a proper challenge, but because they didn't appear on the map, you know, I was like, yeah, hey, fuck it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna seal them all out in, in one run. Because I was hoping they will pop out, you know, on the map. But unfortunately, it didn't. Just 
The range of the spirit is just insane. He was like trying to <laughs> to do some damage up here. Okay, let's kill them. I managed to defeat them. Time to let's see maybe now if we now more of them will pop out. Not really. I'm thinking on this path should be one. Or maybe somewhere close to Darkwood somewhere. Because we... We closed one here... In the yeah, let's go into the dark one. The place of the dead is underground, and let it remain so. But he's just guessing now, you know, because that's the thing. I'm not gonna visit. I'm gonna visit Darkwood. Try to see if we have anything here. Don't. Let me teleport to all of not not all, but let me teleport down there because it's looking like I remember it was the a place in this one where you have plenty of fucking uh or, or cyclops like let's see here ah, we have nothing there. I'm curious if in that, in this pit, we're gonna encounter some, some reef. Ah, cause we've been here. I don't think so. Yeah, it's disappointing in a way. Because I was really hoping that at least they'll appear on the map. Or maybe let's go in and seal the other ones. On the second map. Teleport Greece coastline. Cause down here I saw we have some of the some of some of the rifts as well appeared in this one. So we have like one, two, three, four, five rifts in this. Yeah, let's just move from here straight to the bottom. Uh, I don't know. I think as soon as I'm closing these ones, I'm gonna I'm gonna move on with the main story because I'm. Uh... Okay, so raids appear all over the map now. Shouldn't be here. 
we have a noble there. It's a bit awkward. I like the knockdowns the most when enemies are like CCing the shit out of me. I was trading with the guy. I was hoping I can jump over his attack. I managed to defeat them. Time to go. Damn the Parisian match. These cursed souls won't be coming out of here. Come on. In a way, that's why I hate the spear, because the spear is just working, you know, the zoning attack on it is like kind of the best. And the leaping attack, the leap, leap attack can dodge some skills as well. So I find it extremely useful. Let's see if we pass. We go there. Essence of blood. Okay, so we don't have them. I don't know from where the fuck we can get them. run out of stamina so. okay let's move on to this one this is a pretty We have a cycle there as well. Blocked my my second uh, fucking hell, this is pathetic. I hate that that guys are like the one of the most annoying. See, 
We just and imagine now you fight how many of them, you know. Sometimes you are like, like fighting six. The I think I had like the most of it, I had like eight on me. And you feel like a fucking ping pong ball, you know what I mean? We can see the smith now. These dogs are annoying as fuck. The dogs are like the archers, dual wielders and dogs are annoying. Just two archers can fucking stun the shit out of you. At the same time as if you have dogs on you. They don't give a shit about your attacks sometime. So they're just gonna continuously stun locking you. If you have more than six, it's it's a issue. Okay, so let's teleport here. The thing with the new map, it has too many shrines on it. It has like four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 13, 16, 21, 22, 23, 23 fucking shrines, which is a bit over the top, why we need like so many, I have no clue. Looking for a sturdy shield, or maybe you prefer a more direct approach, what do you need? Yeah, let's see if we can upgrade this now. Nah. I need fucking... Bro, I need so many bronze plates. I need like... 10 bronze plates just to upgrade this. We still have these weapons. I was thinking we'll be able to upgrade them, you know what I mean? But guess what? We won't. Uh, you see this weapon? This is the, I think, it can be the best weapon in game, this one. This one is getting plus 15. This one may be interesting as well. But this just because it's scaling with... With wrath and strength. This one has a pretty low damage, like, you know what I mean? Even if you scale strength in it, it's not like doing a lot. You know what I mean? Let me see something. How many skill points we have? 13. If we go now strength it's adding four so he's not adding a lot of 
experience a lot of damage you know what i mean so it's just basic But if I'm if I'm equipping this one now, because obviously we have uh, forty three strength. If we we'll invest into wrath, it's adding five damage. And if we invest into strength, it's adding yeah. yeah. Yeah, so the soft cap should be somewhere. Actually, let me reset the build and let's check something. I want to see a soft cap on that. Because we can make out of this weapon, like, it's the only weapon which is scaling A with two of them. That's my, my thing. So if we're gonna reset everything now we're gonna have 110 skill points that's that's a lot um so the thing is like this when you start you have your build will look exactly like this yeah mm, this is an interesting path but right now i'm gonna i'm gonna make a guide about this anyway i'm gonna reset myself and just I'm gonna rush for lion first to get the lion out of the way. I'm gonna invest all my points yeah, into this. Yeah, so now we unlock the second skill. Okay, now let's go for... This is actually extra sustain. We unlock this. Okay. We unlock this now. I didn't use this uh, anyway, so let's see. You see now, basically now we are adding eight damage to the weapon. Now we are adding nine damage to the weapon. Now we are adding ten damage to the weapon. Loads of damage is going into that weapon right now. You see, it's still scaling like 15 sometimes. 14 now. 14 now. 15 now. 14 now. You can see the number going low. Now we are on... You see, that's why I'm saying like... They are like soft caps, I guess. 7 in 6 is like 13. But let's check what Wrath will it, will do now. This is adding just 6, basically. So Wrath is not really adding a lot to this weapon. We can still go for this build. Because I want some wrath. And I want to see something. For example, now strength, it's adding 7 and 6, yeah? Uh, that's a 13. If I'm investing, like, into this. This is dropping. We are still on 4, 5. 5. Or now, three now, 
five now. It's awkward. It's awkward because sometimes it's just... It's extremely awkward. That number is awkward as fuck. But now our health is dropped like insanely low amount. So let's go for this. Because we are adding still 13. This now adds 7. So now this weapon is This is adding 7 now You know what I mean It's not really worth it Let me see This is adding just 3 Hmm, let me upgrade the weapon. I have some ideas. Wait a second. If I'm upgrading the weapon, I'm thinking like that. If we are upgrading weapon... Maybe it will scale even better. No, my friend, I'm not looking for a shield and basically I just wanna... See how this shit scales. Divine crystals. Now we need bronze plates and 500 gold. That's. This weapon is on 12. This one is on 10. I'm curious which one is doing like a better damage. Let's test it. Now, obviously, we have like a bigger wrath pool. Like fury pull, you know, because the wrath is adding. Yeah, that's a. That's a pretty this is 1.2. This is 600. It's not extremely bad, though. Considering it, we can like still add even more, you know what I mean? Hmm. I think we need to to destroy most of them. <laughs> we need we need money, and why I'm saying we need money because we can like buy. We can destroy, sacrifice, salvage these weapons. Let me equip it just to see how the fuck it looks like. I want to see how the weapon really hits. Yeah, low numbers, but... If I'm using the spear now, the spear is basically I'm getting better. Yeah, the, the damage on spear is not bad, but could be way better. I 
I see the spear still better than the sword in a way. Let me see how much it costs to to buy a bronze plate because I remember I saw bronze plates on him. So basically we can buy them, you know what I mean? So fuck it. Let's see buy. Oh my fucking god guys, this is expensive as fuck. We're gonna waste like fucking two point 5k on just buying this yeah let me buy this and let me now sacrifice weapons or salvage weapons how it's supposed to so let's salvage this let's salvage this this is scaling with strength i'm fine with that that's scaling with strength i'm Fine with that. Endurance, I'm not a big fan. Endurance, I'm not a big fan again. Bro, we, we don't have like enough shit to sacrifice. It scales with wrath though, but. This is an extremely interesting weapon. This weapon is extremely, extremely interesting. The crit on it. It's like 500% damage. This is still... This is still lower. Let's, let's do math. So you have 320, 1. Let's say 320. Plus 520. No, 620. 420 plus 420, you know what I mean? Because this is like, the first number is like 420, yeah? The second number is like 620. So we are on 1000. Yeah, this scales better. This one scales better. But I'm not I'm not surprised to be fair with you. Because basically this scales the same amount with strength. But even though if you can compare them, because look, I'm gonna show you another thing. You are equipping this. And now basically if you go to skills and you invest into strength, this will add 14 damage. And meanwhile, the second one will add just fucking 11. Yeah, but still though, 11 is not bad. We have 40 skill points. We can invest like... If we go... 10 points more, 20 points more into, let's do that. Anyway, I think I'm going to reset it and play the spear like, but I want to see the amount of damage this, this weapon can do. Because I want to have a guide for this one, because this looks like the best weapon in game. So let's go skill tree. And now if we go for this. I well, see it already dropped on 5. So as soon as we reach 40. It's another cap on 40. Okay. So the weapon is not scaling better now. It's, it's taking just 5. But... Let's put it this way. If you equip this one and you go skills now.
Yeah, it's adding 6. So yeah, it's not really worth it. I'm thinking if we upgrade the both weapons, yeah, they will be like chunky fucking numbers. But in the same time... I don't know what to say about it. In the same time, if we level it up, because if we level up this on the same level as the, the... I need them both on the same level. To run a proper test, because... It looks like... This weapon... Can overpass damage on this one. Because you, you see, you are you are getting more damage with this. Even if you drop like 559, you get like 647, you know what I mean? And let me see how it scales with precision right now. Because for example, if you go in precision... Yeah, but we need to equip the other one. I'm thinking maybe precision will bump it up. Because it's scaling C with precision, but who knows what. It's adding 5, so basically we can get another 5 from this one. Because now we are getting 5 from strength, you know, so it's not really worthy. And we get like with wrath, we get like 5 as well. And with precision, we get 5. Ah, yeah, fuck it, it's not like... The thing is, this weapon, I definitely recommend if you guys play this game and you didn't upgrade any weapons and you didn't, didn't made all this bullshit, what I did. Hmm. I definitely recommend you upgrading that shit. Let me buy one more of this so I can upgrade the armor. Because for me, I was like testing with weapons a lot. I wasn't investing loads of points. Another thing, if you play, if you just start a game now. And you don't go for a deathless run. Because what I did, I went for a deathless run, you know, that was my... My thing, but... If you don't go for a deathless run, invest into this fucker. Maximize it. You're gonna get more... You can, you can maximize luck. I don't know if luck is scaling. I don't think so. It's just getting better drops. But you can maximize that shit. I'm thinking to give it a try with this weapon. Or to just reset my build. Go back to the basic spear shit. Because I'm going to be honest with you, I, I'm not a really big fan of two-hand swords. Two-hand swords are decent, but not my cup of tea. That's why, I, I don't know, I prefer dual wielding, you know. Dual wielding, from my point of view, is, is one of the best in the game. I didn't invest a lot into it and mainly just because I couldn't find a weapon, a second weapon and I start testing all the weapons meanwhile. So I end up spending like loads of points for nothing. And I lost some of materials, not a lot of them to be fair with you, because I didn't lose like bronze plates. I lost just like some money, like 4k. But it's not a lot. And even if I'm going, let me go strength anyway. Fuck okay. Yeah, but see, it's not worth it anymore. It's adding just 4 damage. 3 damage. I'm gonna invest again into HP.
So I don't 50 HP. Let's go on 53 HP. I'm thinking to go on. Yeah, right now, see, if you play this weapon, I definitely recommend you go for Wrath. Because it's adding 5. It's adding 4 now, it's adding again 4 now. Now it's adding 5. Now it's adding 4 again. We are on 9 here. We need to take some skill. <laughs> but the thing is like... Uh, this guy... Maybe... Maybe worth him. Let me unlock this. Soul drain. Lock it and unlock it. And now we unlock this shit as well. As well. Let me go. This is adding 5. Let me go 1 precision. Because precision is adding 5 as well. Yeah, it's adding 5. Yeah. Yeah, let me... Let, let, now let's test this. You know. Uh, I'm gonna do a full... A full test on this thing. We are being again on a big fucking number, a chunky fucking number. Uh, let's equip some spells for this one. This swing was. I'm curious. Curious how a swing. Oh, 1.1. Trying to kill <laughs> there with this, it's kind of funny. The amounts of damage on this weapon are insane. Let me try to use the skill. That's just lame. It was nice the the skills to scale as well with some uh, some of the attributes. You know what I mean? That was in a way interesting. So right now let's go and Oh, we have a uh... Oh, let me test this on him. Oh, four fucking fouls. Are you kidding? Me? That's a single target, but that's sick. Yeah, and this weapon it's it's extremely good just because it's clearing like Yeah this weapon is insane. You can almost one shot definitely use this for boss. You know what I mean? Cause uh, this looks like if you wanna if you fight if you fight a single target. Oh we can use the drain. Wait, wait, wait. Because I have that skill now. Why is not allowing me to drain here? I want to see how drain works. Because we unlock that wrath thing. So let's go to this one. Kill the bastard. Guys, I want to just use a, a skill to test the skill guys, chill the fuck out. Let me try to use it on this. I don't understand why he's not allowing me to train. Oh, I think I was supposed to hold it. Jesus, I'm so fucking stupid. I thought you just tap it, you know, and it's, it will start doing some 
bullshit magic like I'm gonna call this the vampire build bro Kill the bastard. guys come on I just wanna test some she stop attacking me you fucking dickheads the guy is doing some tests and you are like feeling like so bad I say yeah, let's see this Bro, that skill is lame. I I don't I can't see that shit working. Where am I going here when I'm supposed to go here? I swear to God, I, I can't really see that skill working, you know what I mean? It's even if we'll scale with with wrath to say so because let's put it like okay i'm gonna have a, a full wrath build even though i don't see the point of having a full wrath build anyway i think i'm gonna reset my build i wanna i wanna complete it with spear because this one is interesting but i'm not a big fan you can like fucking one shot two shot the boss because you're gonna have like fucking insane amounts of damage with that you can basically kill the boss, let's say, almost instantly, like. You haven't learned anything, Achilles. Do you think you can end another war? Another croc. I stopped him from talking. That was four boss anyway. He is like just trolling you. Asking me if I can stop the war. It's like... What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, this... This weapon is like... Just because it can clear fucking fast. So if you spin, the whirlwind will gonna fucking shred for enemies like you know. Even on auto attack it's like it's annoying because it's a bit slower than the But it's a timing like which you're gonna learn anyway. HP just oh we fight the scorpion king again how are you my friend long time no see this guy was funny I'm just heavy heavy attacking him if you wanna end the fight extremely fast just use this See if I can one shot this now. But I'm not far away from doing it. <laughs> I went into that. Bro, that this this weapon is ridiculous, bro. This weapon's heavy, can one shot enemies, you know. 
Not all of them. But good idea is most of them, you know. And trust me, you can go even more. Because right now we are on what? Uh, we are on 48, 31 wrath, 52 ish P. Vitality like. I definitely recommend you go for strength, you know. Fuck, fuck this. Go, just go for strength, you know. Uh, I don't see it like. I'm really not seeing it like worthy investing more into wrath. You know, maybe. I don't see it worthy because I saw there are soft caps on 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 upgrades basically. Bro, one shot, are you kidding me? Yeah. This weapon is, is by far the best in game. It's satisfying. Yeah, for sure you're gonna... 3000 3000... Oh my fucking god. 3000 it's a fucking... You can one shot everything with 3000. What's the... The crit on it though. Yeah, you should definitely go for this one. It's adding... 100 plus each damage, you know. In the same time. Oh my fucking, I have just 1000 gold left. I'm thinking if I'm removing this. But even though this is not bad because it's adding kind of the same amount of damage. Well, we have strength. Here is strength, no? Yeah. Four, and if we go for precision, it's five. So actually right now, precision is giving you the most. Hmm, I'm thinking to upgrade the weapon, like... I'm really thinking on upgrading this weapon. But I'm gonna lose, like... So much money... Just to test with that shit. I don't know if it's worthy. Because I want to upgrade my... My spear to a maximum level, you know, not... I really don't wanna invest into this world like a lot. Cause I bet... People on the internet already... Broke this one. But I can see the... The build. Doable. Extremely doable. It's by far the best weapon in the game. It's a, it's a no-brainer, you know, you can go for it. And as you saw, depending on the level of the weapon, I guess, the scaling worth investing even into precision. I'm gonna, before we're gonna seal all this. Gonna, I'm gonna test even more so just to, uh, to understand like soft caps and things like because apparently we have like some soft caps we don't have soft caps like on uh, 
on uh, vitality but some soft caps are like in getting in, in weapon upgrade upgrading uh, upgradement and all that things you know are like involving some of it because the way weapons are scaling bro stop fucking oh my god oh my god i just hate this shit. when i see myself like going left and right like a fucking pinball bro i don't like it at all check this shit bro. are you kidding me? chill the fuck down guy he was eating some i think he just did something, I don't know why. Gamemnon, how are you my friend? This weapon is trolling the shit out of him. But he is a unicorn now, what the fuck? He has something in, on top of his head. He looks like a fucking unicorn. But he's not him anymore. His face is fucked. Chill out my brother. I would love to have this axe, I'm telling you. Imagine getting this weapon. You know what I mean? Can you pick it up? No, he can't. For fuck's sake. No. I really wanted like a dual, like a two hand axe, you know what I mean? I think that. That was the best shit they could add to the game. That's why, I, in a way, I don't like this weapon. Sometimes it just misses. I did some tests with this before, you know. And even... Um, even back then, I was still missing sometimes. And I wasn't happy about it. How the fuck I missed that chest, bro? And now that chest is giving me some fucking badass weapon. Yeah, I don't think so. I can hear a skeleton king. What the fuck is that chest? Right here are two options. It's even... I'm blind. I swear to, oh, okay, it's there. I swear to God, I couldn't see it.
endurance healing is Wait, I wanna go there. I want to reset myself first, but... Because uh, this one... What the fuck? Come on, let me use this. I wanna go up there, but the only thing is like... I really don't wanna fight all this. Here, guys. It's like a horror scene. Up here is like fucking shit. It's annoying. This area is annoying. You are fighting like so many raids. I shield the fuck out. I'm not in the mood. My guy could like soul drain. A fucking skeleton. Come on, boy, let me drain. Yeah. Yeah, he's draining actually skeleton. This was a massive battle. to upgrade this weapon but I bet someone already did on it on, if you check the internet for sure someone already did it because this weapon is like a no-brainer this is like the best weapon in the games I f by far okay so they are like that's why it was taking me yesterday so long to defeat them bro because I was using spear and I'm gonna finish the game with a spear and I'm gonna ca come back with the spear and you're gonna see they are annoying this weapon is easy as fuck this is by far the best weapon in the game so if you wanna go for the best weapon in the game just use this it's by far the best to do is like just to spin to win it's like so easy I'm doing this over and over again and, and, and it's impossible for you to get your life This is not even fine. I'm gonna that that will be like a clip on it. Then. That will be a video about this. Just about that shit. I don't know if you understood what. Uh, it's not like if you understood, because <laughs> it's not like you need to to get some. You are like, you are like just fucking stun. Like, yeah. It's like gen, just a continuous stun lock, which is extremely annoying and frustrating. 
The only way they can kill you is death. That's the only way this game can kill you. Hmm. I got plenty of achievements, but I didn't. Because meanwhile, even yesterday, it, I heard some, some pop-ups with some of the. What? 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 What the fuck was that? What the fuck was that shit? My guy fought like, oh, let me show you something. I know how to do this. Bro, I dodged into it, but... Because it's always a butt. The regeneration on these weapons. A bit lame. Yeah, so apparently we sealed all the rifts. Now we can move on. I don't wanna I don't wanna complete the game with this weapon. I don't wanna use this weapon mm, just because it's a bit a bit too easy. And I don't know how the fuck the boss will gonna look like, but... I hope it will be like that. Because with this, for example, imagine you just spam E. All these bosses can be like flawlessly killed. You see, this game is not having a save option, bro. You have, it's automatically saving over one single slot, you know what I mean? And that's the most annoying thing. Because I would, like, enjoy to have, like, a save point where I can, like, fucking test bosses and all that things, you know? But... It's not really working like that. But now I'm stuck in between them. Bro, what the fuck is this game about, bro? fighting the same enemies but on this area you will feel like a fucking pinball you know what I mean let's loot all these items because maybe we can sell them <laughs> me and my uh my thoughts like bro we need we need money fuck this shit we need money i'm gonna fucking sell everything it's shit that you you don't have like my friend get the fuck out i was fighting these ones all fucking game long it's not like i wanted the extra motherfucker yeah, so let's let's go to the teleport. Why the camera is pulling me there, I don't know. Oh, we have this shit, bro. Wait a second. Wait a second, because I'm daft. But I guess you already realized that. I bet someone which was like watching the f me opening the map was like, bro, go and take that one, bro, go and take that shit, what the fuck are you doing? Stop fighting all these fucking useless mobs and, and yeah, they are useless. Oh, this is the place where I wanted to be. Mm. 
The only thing which I really don't like with this weapon is like the fucking endurance. Endurance wise, you can bump it up a bit. Because anyway, you'll have like plenty of levels. To spend. What the fuck, bro? Why, bro? Ah, it's a plant hero. I'm so blind, bro. They're like fucking... Good job, my friend. You managed to unlock almost all of them because this one is not uh, and I I don't know what the fuck it was like pure pure blood essence or what the fuck I was needing for that shit I think it was pure blood essence yeah let's I didn't want it to use that I wanted to press F but my boy is like Insane in the membrane. Let's try to teleport now to Greece. To see if maybe all the rifts appear now. Come on. Fuck this, bro. You know. Hope never dies or something. And now let's move. Why the camera is going there every single fucking time? Let's see. Let's see this. Sturdy shield, or maybe you prefer a more direct approach. What do you need? Bro, I, to be fair with you, I want to upgrade this shit. Oh, we can actually can, bro. We have bronze ingots, like five of them. Oh, okay. So we just need money. To get more money, bro, we need to fucking sell shit. Let me become a vendor. We can like just... Uh, it's awkward how... They called it sacrifice. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna fuck this one up. I'm gonna use it in a new game plus if I'm I don't think I'm gonna play it again. If sometimes I wanna go back on getting myself lobotomized, I can like do this. So right now we can sell all this shit. Increase resistance to burn. Fuck it, I did I never needed that shit. Poison, fuck it bro, I can tank that shit. Okay. This is actually interesting. I'm gonna keep that, because it's just temporary increased resistance to all negative effect, burn, poison, curse, and bleed. This removes all negative stats. This removes a curse. Fuck it. Someone's getting rich, bro. Okay, what the fuck are this one? Yeah, so we're gonna keep just the ones which Bro How much money we have Oh boy and we are not even Oh, we can fucking get loads of money, guys. Come on, bro. For a while, I was like, what the fuck am I pressing? I'm pressing guy. Why? And that's why it's like... Bro. 
shit, I could have free K, bro. Another 2k, are you kidding me, bro? Guys, we are rich, fuck this. We don't give a shit about it, bro. Sell all this shit. These ones are not really worthing a lot. Who needs darts, bro? Who the fuck needs that, bro? We have here patterns. Large. We'll keep only the large ones. Traps. Traps are useless, bro. I tested them. They are a waste of time. You're gonna fucking drop one trap. The traps basically are not bad. I'm not saying they are bad, yeah. Major damage, major. Okay, let's let's keep them for just for the lols. When apply to a weapon, cause the major major additional for a very short time. That's the thing. It's the short time. Uh, darkness. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Yeah, okay, let's let's fucking sell darkness. Who needs darkness, bro? In his life, life is pretty dark sometimes. Why we need extra darkness, bro? Uh, this shit. We can sell this shit as well. Fuck it. Meat. I sell meat, bro. Feeling like a butcher now. That may be interesting, you know, because that's the only thing interesting for a short time. For a long time. You see, them two are interesting in a way. I recommend you to keep them. Even if you won't really need them, right? I didn't... Till now, I, I fought all the bosses in this game without even prepping, you know what I mean? Without even equipping at least the Fury Potions, you know what I mean? Because Fury Potions are OP as fuck. You can just spam shit. But now let's upgrade. Looking for a sturdy shield? Or maybe you prefer a more direct approach? What do you need? That one is like maximum level. Now we need to... Now we need to level up this. Yeah, yeah. So we need bronze plates, like four of them. Uh, bronze plates... Bro, let's buy like fucking 20, because we have money now, so... Okay, we took that one out of the way, so... I'm gonna upgrade this, upgrade this... Upgrade this... I'm gonna upgrade this, upgrade this, upgrade this... Oh, we can actually, bro, we're gonna have enough money, guys. So we don't need to worry about it. We're gonna have enough money. Yeah. Will be the... Uh, let's buy like... I don't even know. Let's buy 10 more. Uh, 
You're saying we, we have enough money, but we already dropped on 9k, bro. I don't know what enough money we are having. And now I want this shield upgraded. Or I want this shield. This shield. The thing with the shields is like this. This shield. I just want it because it's saying like gives resistance to all negative statues. Stat, uh, statuses. I don't know what's the deal with the this shield. Give resistance to all negative statuses. What it means like it, it negates all the statuses. Because that would be badass, you know what I mean? And even if you upgrade it, it's not looking like it's giving extra, you know what I mean? It's not giving you extra resistance, you know? This is the best shield you can get, it's like 100 to everything. I still, I'm still keeping this because it's a Spartan shield and I love Spartans. I'm still keeping this because it, it's looking nice, you know. It's looking beautiful. This one is like interesting. And this one is is nice because it reminds me of a Kraken or some fucking... I think it's a Kraken on the shield. And here you have an Owl on the shield. Here, here you have like a, a Bull's head. More like a bull skull, you know what I mean? But can be even an armor plate for a horse. Like head plate. And now... Well, well, well. Yeah, I think I want to upgrade this, just because. Uh, what is required to bronze fragments? We're gonna need one. We're gonna need one, and after that another ten, I guess. So we're gonna need eleven of them. I think so. Yeah. And now we have the bronze plate. And no, we don't. Bro, we, <laughs> we run out of fucking money again. Fuck my life, bro. Bro, 20 fucking K we spent on this shit. Are you kidding me, guys? Yeah, but the only thing is now we can't even like what the fuck we should sell now, bro. Send sell a liver or something, you know, a fucking kidney, bro. Because without liver we cannot live. So let's sell our fucking kidney, bro. Now, or sell our soul, you know what I mean? Fucking hell. Bombs. Who the fuck needs bombs? Bombs are for cunts. We have the classic ones. We stay classic, bro. Fire, fire, bro. I'm not a fucking pyromaniac, bro. Poison, I'm not a venomancer. Yeah, we are back on 5k, so... Oh, it's adding a star next to it. That's, that's kind of interesting. Why I'm going into skills? We have seven, though. Uh, yeah, first let's let's upgrade the weapon, and after that we're gonna see like more things. Upgrade, yeah, yeah. Bronze plates, we need three. Bro, we don't have enough money. I'm telling you, we don't have enough money. We already lost one thousand there. Yeah. Upgrading it. Bronze plate. We need like four more now. Uh, 
Yeah, we have it on the maximum level. Yeah. Doesn't even matter from this point on, bro. We have like 74, but it matters because I want to respect myself. And guess what? We have like... Oh, but we can always sell potions. Who the fuck needs potions, bro? Let's get there, like around 1.5. We can sell even more, let's say like another 1.5 worth of potions. Yeah, we are fine with this. Having 60 potions is more than enough. Oh, potions are like not a requirement on this game. So like now let's equip something which we may use. We may use that. And we may use this. But instead of... I'm not gonna fucking use that shit, bro. It's better to have this equipped in case you'll need like a extra attack or something. But now I need some tough opponents, you know what I mean? And besides this, we need... Uh, oh my fucking god, I'm such an idiot, bro. Pure essence of I don't remember what. I sold everything. I sold my soul. <laughs> you remember <laughs> here we were required like 20 pure fucking... I don't know what pure essence of blood or something i think i just sold them how can i check my inventory pure shit we have like no no uh, fuck them details you know what i mean they're just details so right now let's test the thing like skill tree because i want to i want to give like the best advice for this weapon yeah so this divine motherfucker yeah so even if we are like level let me see what the weapon i have equipped okay so for divine justice yeah so let's let's use divine justice so for divine justice best stats will be Drum roll now. Yeah, 48 is not worth it anymore. This is adding 4, though. It may work. Let me invest one more. It's adding 5, though. 5, though, bro. Are you kidding me? Let me see precision, like. Oh. Precision was sick there, adding seven. Now it's adding three, which you don't really want. You want to stay with. No, you don't want to stay with. Strength. So actually right now I think the weapon is on maximum damage. Let me see. Let me see. It's almost one shot in these plants. But you definitely want to go on precision a bit because you're gonna get like a seven seven uh if not i can reset it let me reset this build like fully yeah so this is for justice yeah divine justice so for divine justice you want to invest into 
I wanna, I wanna give you a proper guide about this weapon. Because I think it's the best one. And to get a maximum amount of damage. You know. You need to test this. And I'm gonna test it for you guys. Even though I'm not gonna use it. To defeat the last boss. But I'm gonna test it. Because look, now you get like 24. So we are on the point where... Where strength is the best thing to invest into it. I'm curious if precision is still... Precision is 7 right now. I'm curious how, how we'll, we'll do it as soon as we got like... So see the soft cap on this is not 30 yet. Okay, but apparently it's, it's dropping everything down. So you can get six out of that. Let's let's invest like some points into this. You get five now, and how much you get now? This stays on fifteen, yeah. This drops like this drops fast. We are on we are on six there. Uh, now Wrath is scaling beautiful with it, so you can go Wrath now. You get like a a decent amount with Wrath. You get eight, though, which is still, is still a better value, you know. So you still get eight. You get six now. You get seven. Seven. Six. Seven again. Now you are on five. Seven again. Five. Five. Seven, five, five again, five again. Now we are on four here, so let's move on with the other one because four is a small number. So let's go five here. Let's go seven, five. We're gonna try to get like the most value of this weapon. Five. We are. The teddy bear is full now. So let's focus on... Because we have here some strength. So let's see. Now it's dropping on free. Okay. Let's keep in mind this shit. Let's go back to Wrath now. This is a 4. So we're going to get a better value from Wrath. But let's try Precision. Because Precision is giving us 5 right now. So pre precision is still giving you five. Now precision gives you three. Okay. Hmm. So right now all of them are giving you plus three. Yeah. Yeah. So when you reach forty-eight. 16, 31, yeah, all of them, if you invest one point in each one of the attributes, strength, precision, wrath, will give you like plus three, I know it will scale better with wrath and, and, uh, and strength basically, but I want to invest one more point, uh, I'm, I'm going to add like plus one in each one of them, you know, to see which one will gonna give you the best value? So let's go one wrath. It's switching back to five. Let's go. Okay, but it's switching it back to five, even for strength. You know what I mean? Because now strength is giving you like five, and now precision is giving you five. 
See what I mean? And now strength is giving you five. Oh, so basically this is a bullshit, bro. There are no soft caps on this. Bro, what the fuck? What weapon I'm using, bro? It's like so confusing for me now. I have divine justice equipped. Yeah, bro. Guys, so... The, okay, so... I don't know what to say about this game. It's fucked up. Number-wise, this game is a total bullshit. Yeah, I, I'm still maintaining my fucking... Thoughts about this game. About number-wise, this game is shit. How the fuck... If I have 32... How the fuck? It's scaling like the same, you know? If I'm... This, this weapon scales C with precision, yeah? So basically, C with precision means this weapon will add 4 damage. If you if you invest into wrath, you're gonna get the same amount. And guess what? If you're gonna invest into strength, you're gonna get the same amount. So it really doesn't matter. You know what I mean? So this really doesn't matter, like. Because now you get 4 with that. Free with this, okay, so it's scaling worse now with precision. And it's scaling free with that. Okay, okay, let's let's go wrath. Okay, let's try to see. Now it's scaling four there. The fuck is this strength? Four. Precision four. Bro, this game is a bit awkward. Okay, so we went wrath. Now, if we go strength or precision, doesn't really matter. Now, if we go wrath or precision, doesn't really matter because it's kind of the same shit. But if we go strength, we'll be lower. My brain is fried. Trying to understand this. My brain is getting fucking fried, bro. I don't... I, I can't see... How is this working like? Let me invest one more point into... Let's invest one more in that. Now, this is... Four. All of them are four. Yeah. Let me go strength. All of it is four now. Okay, so let's me let's go strength again. Now if we check with wrath, it's lowered. Precision is lowered. Let's go precision. Nope, it's adding five. Okay, let's go wrath. I'm feeling like I'm cracking the Da Vinci's code right here, bro. Let's see Wrath now. Four. This one is like... Let me go Precision again. And now Wrath is scaling better. Okay, Wrath is worth it now. Now we have two plus two. Two plus two. Two plus two. So now let's go against Strength. Two plus one. Two plus one. Let's go again precision, because I saw precision sometimes is bumping up the damage. Okay, let's go again precision. That's a 4. Now let's go raw. Let's go again precision. Let's go again precision. And let's go wrath because he's giving one extra. Now it's four. Four. 
Whoa. Okay, let's go again, Wrath. Now it's 1-1, one, one, okay. Now it's 2-1. Two, one, and 2-1. Two, one. Let me go Precision. What's this thing? 2-2. Two, 2-1. Two, two, one. Two, one. Okay, let me go Strength. This game is... Uh, this game is a bit awkward. Now you have free there. And now you have free here. I need strength, bro. Okay, let's move on with it. We need strength, so yeah, let's go there. I know it's strength somewhere here. No, there's vitality, yes. So yeah, we have free now on this. Free on that. Let's see. Wrath, okay. Okay, what should we invest into? Let, let's invest precision again. Because we're gonna reach a soft cap or something, so. So that's free. This is free. And this is free as well. Let's go precision again. Fucking precision build, bro. Where the fuck is that shit? We need. But no, guys, I think. You're gonna need. Nah, nah, nah. There are like more than enough points invested. I'm gonna stop here because it's pointless. If you have more than. More than this amount of points, you are already. Don't give a shit about points anymore. You know what I mean? Because I've invested like 100 points in Divinity. In uh, Divine Justice, yeah? And we maximize the damage of it. Like, we managed to get like 1.5k. You're gonna squeeze like just a plus one bonus damage. But you need to pay attention on which, which attribute you will invest, yeah? So right now, let me test this. This will be like one-shotting most of the shit. It's 5k, bro. That's a 5 fucking K damage, are you kidding? This is a 2 point fucking free. Let me see if I can destroy a plant. Our HP though is low. But really don't give a shit about HP because anyway we have like... What the fuck is that? Welcome to... Achilles, Legends Online, Legends, Untold, bro, this is pathetic. <laughs> yeah, so let's try to find the enemy which... Look, this one. They weren't dying one shot before, but now they are. So actually, guys, I guess that's the... If you have more than 125 skill points. I I don't know if you really you need to be aware of what the fuck are you doing, you know, just spend points there like a crazy. But at least this is how the weapon looks. On fucking 100 points invested into like a build for it you know what I mean it's extremely satisfying to say so I think it's the best weapon in the game because by far you have you have I don't know it's like the best point route you could have because you saw we like we were like squeezing because in some of them you were like investing and it was like free in some of them if you invest precision it was like going fucking five sometimes and if you're going for strength it was like just a lower number so in this way basically i think these are the best 
this is the best way to invest the points like because we invested one by one checking all the attributes you know what i mean so you're gonna get on a row 1.5 you have like physical damage 615 divine 911 call 911 <laughs> this weapon is sick yeah so I don't want to compare it now with a different weapon because if I'm comparing it now with a spear, I'll be like, why the fuck I'm playing spears, you know? But spears are cool, guys. Look. Beside that, you look badass. You can equip this moon shield, bro. So no, now we are like, I don't like the how the armor looks. I'm telling you from. From beginning the armor looks like shit i'm feeling like i'm playing zeus online or something legends untold zeus legends untold i don't know what the fuck i'm saying legends online uh let me reset this 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 spear can create 500 percent damage a crit from this spear is like fucking 500% damage. And look, you'll still have points because I wasn't, I wasn't talking about this, yeah. But you'll still have points to invest into. Because you can still complete your build. Oh, fuck, I invested one extra there. I, I wasn't supposed to. I swear to God, I don't see what's missing. <laughs> Guys, what the fuck is wrong with me? I'm blind. Ah, this one is missing. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah, and basically you can still have like extra free points. <laughs> no, you have like four of them, but even though you want to reach that, you re reach this, this, and this. But with that extra point, which I invested it over here, you could put it here, and that was your build. Like having the full whale, you have the full strength build. You have some of these fucking Cupidon motherfucker unlocked. You have the lion unlocked. So basically, and if I wasn't so daft and I was investing one more point into this, you could have this as well. You know what I mean? So anyway i invested like points for nothing look because i have a point here invested extra a point here invested extra another point here invested extra so basically you could make this viable because you can see the extra points they are like useless remove one from here invest it wherever it needs to in this and you're gonna unlock this yeah Remove another point from there, invest it into this. Because anyway, I don't think you're gonna need it. You have like four extra. Here you have five extra points just on this three, on this four of them, or five of them. Down here, yeah, that's fine. So take this extra five, invest them into four of them, invest them into vitality, and one of it just invest it into this. So you're gonna unlock at least the absorption as well. Which will be handy, you know, I mean. So I think that's the best build for a divine ju uh, divine justice. Uh, and with all that saying, guys, I'm gonna end the, the video here because I'm pretty tired. Uh, but the thing is, like, I'm gonna continue tomorrow and I'm gonna finish the game tomorrow, you know. At least the, we have the divine build completed. I'm gonna give you more details in-depth details about like 
what I'm gonna play because I'm gonna play the spear anyway. I'm gonna do like some tests, couple of them, and I'll go to, to be the boss. And after that, I guess that's it. I don't know if I'm gonna start a new game plus, but we're gonna see. Maybe just to kill parties to take my revenge on that motherfucker. Who knows? But uh, thanks for your patience, guys, and for thanks again for watching. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Take care.